Hello everybody, my name is Bloodbath169 and welcome back to The Sims 3. In our last episode, uh, we sent Derek on a bit of a journey trying to explore the neighborhood and see if there's not a uh, attractive young lady that might capture his heart and mind. And uh, we did find one, a young lady by the name of Miranda. Um, so we are going to, in this episode, enjoy the pursuit. The, the pursuit in the name of love and everything there is to do with that. I sound like I'm setting up an anime episode. In a world described by love and affection. One man. No, I'm just kidding. But no, we're going to pursue uh, Miranda and um, maybe we can talk her out of that tiny little shack she lives in. We'll just have to kind of see. But as it happens, we've got Derek through his morning. We're going to go ahead and have him do his gardening. The schedule's kind of thrown off because we stayed up late talking, trying to find Miranda, actually, because she wasn't at home for most of the day. So he's going to do the gardening stuff. He's going to come over here and go fishing. He'll never catch anything using a tomato. But, you know, details. Now we have a... Well, we did have a phone call, but it wasn't anything important, apparently. Oh, yes, we did also in our last episode find flame fruit. I don't think we have the ability to plant them yet, but we did find them. Uh, can we plant? We cannot plant these two. Okay. Okay. So, we've got these regrown. That's good. We're going to level up our fishing skill here in a sec. We work today. Today is Monday. Yes, we do work in seven hours. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We finish that out. So head on back home. Congratulations, Derek has improved his fishing load to level three. Fishing skill to level three. Derek has, now has a good chance of catching some new types of fish. Try out different spots to find different types of fish. Look for hot spots where the fish are most visible. And try switching to a different spot if fish stop biting. Okay. Uh, the thing, the big thing that we're going to try for, I think, is we are going to make the most of uh, Derek's interest in Miranda. And we're actually going to see if we can't oops, see if we can't uh, start up the charisma skill for him, and then start up we start with uh, Miss Miranda. So we're going to fast forward really quick here at the start of our episode, and uh, or maybe we won't because this is. Uh, Increasing awfully quickly. More than likely we will. Even if it's just for a second. Zoom! Alright, Derek is ready for the lifestyle of fantastic conversation, becoming a socialite of renown, and always knowing the right thing to say. To become more charismatic, Derek will constantly need to get out and socialize with Sims in the neighborhood. Well, funny story about that. We have a charming introduction wish. Pay your bills. Okay, so that was a less valuable space rock. That's fine. Send these off to go get cut. And then we'll send him off to work. For which he needs to... What days are game days? Wednesday. So you can actually... Um, snack off. Build up your fun skill or your fun motive, and then we will fast forward once more. You won! You won! The crowd's going wild. You were an absolute fiend on the field, an incredible tour de force of athletic perfection. You have earned the cash. Nice.
All right, guys, so we're back, and Derek is now prepping for his day of romantic attractions. Oh, the mail is already right back. Nice. Let's get the mail there. He doesn't have a wish to check himself out. We did that. Yep, I don't do that in the mirror. You can stop doing that because that's cringy as all get out. And you also might have seen me uh, set an order to make ratatouille. Uh, that is because I think uh, tomatoes are the highest quality produce we currently have. Oh, there goes the dishwasher. So repair that. And mop up the puddle once you're done. But we're still trying to get this objective or this opportunity we got in our last episode to create an excellent meal. And it still didn't work. Oh crap, okay. Well, we got a bunch of stuff. We got the metals from the smelter and a couple of our things down there. So, there's that. Go ahead and put Ratatouille away. It's due by Tuesday. I don't know if we're going to manage that, to be honest. Okay, so... Let's send him out here, and he's going to start gardening, if it will let me. There it goes. Okay, so our tomatoes grew in again. That's a excellent quality plant. Created an outstanding quality tomato, so let's dispose of that. or lettuce, I don't think. Excellent quality lettuce. Great quality, so we did get some lettuce. And it looks like we got some apples, too. Great quality apples, very nice tree. So, dispose of the tree. And we're ready for the tomatoes. And then we have our lettuce. Or would if he'd move. Are you really trying to go back to bed, dude? Get up for the day. Jeez, even I'm not that lazy. Yep, this is why we moved up to the hills. That way Derek can do his gardening his underwear. Totally, totally. Change into your everyday outfit, you weirdo. Okay. Now, let's see. Can we invite or call, if it'll let me move it, can we call Miss Miranda? I know she was here. There she is. Let's invite her over, actually. I don't know if she'll come, but... Okay, so we're going to have to work on her a little bit. So let's uh, chat with her. Chit, chit, chat. Every little bit helps. She already snubbed us, so she didn't want to come over. Cool. Go take a pish. And what did that do for our relationship? Uh, I didn't really make it. But we uh, asked you repeatedly to come over. Okay, so she's on her way over. Nice. All right, guys, so we have Miss Miranda on her way over. Let's go ahead and get the mail again. What's in the mail? More gems that we sent out to get cut. Nice. There's Miranda. Don't greet her rudely. Don't start off like that. Idiot. What's this? Listen. I think she's talking about cooking. Okay. So let's start running through our thing here. Ask about their her career. Let's chat. Let's enthuse about the outdoors. Let's get to know her. Not funny. Gossip. And let's uh, talk about family. She is unemployed. Carpool's arriving in about an hour. Things were being boring. Alright, let's 
let's leave her at the house and I guess we'll go to work. That's not awkward at all, right? So let's go and uh, keep up with Derek as we go to work here once again. So I think we made some pretty good progress. Not a lot of progress, but some progress with Miss Miranda. Uh, yeah, we made some progress. She's still listed as an acquaintance. Not a big deal. All right, guys, and we are back. So we're gonna get. Did he sleep on the other side of the bed? Okay, whatever. Okay, so he just ate breakfast. He didn't really need need to, but we do have a little bit of time until that's ready to go. So keep boosting channels. And today we're gonna see what what other kind of progress we can make with Miss Miranda. We're gonna try being funny today because that's totally how that works, right? Totally, totally. How it works. Hubba 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 hubba. No, I'm just kidding. But it is seriously almost ten, almost uh, the morning time here. On we did fail our. Uh, I'm sure you guys saw that. We did fail our uh, opportunity because unfortunately. Yeah, it didn't, uh, we didn't make a, couldn't produce a meal high enough quality to make the challenge, so unfortunately we missed the opportunity. Alright, well that's it as far as that goes. Let's, uh, how far are we, or how close are we on this? We're going to wait till at least 10, 8 a.m. and then we're going to start, uh, we know that Miranda is not employed, so we can always invite her over at any time, as long as it's not an ungodly time in the morning. So we're going to wait till at least 8 just to be on the safe side. I mean, if the man, she's not impressed by a man that can boost his own channels with a screwdriver on a big screen, hmm. Tell me, let me tell you a story about that. Alright, so she's on her way over. What can we do in the meantime? Well, why don't we uh, improve crushing? Alright, so. Let's, um. Uh, let's actually max this out. Goof around, impersonate a celebrity, make a funny face, tell a funny story, tell a joke. And then we're going to go back to friendly and do chat. Get to know. <coughs> uh, where's you going? Where are you going? <coughs> You're going home. Why are you going home? I'm not done with you. Just kidding. I may be done with you. For today. I have a game today. So, stupid question. She just left and went home randomly, so invite her back over. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> yep, I can. Nice. Don't have anything else to do while we're waiting for her to come back, though, so let's go back and keep upgrading our uh, trash compactor. Okay, now I'm suspicious. You just got up here with a limousine? <coughs> Homie G? <coughs> Chase him. We're just going to focus on humor, I think, because humor is doing what's... <coughs> humor is what's doing best with you. So we're humor, humor. It's Get out there and start yik-yakking. And this way we're not constantly repeating our interactions. Let's make sure we're at least friendly. We're friends with her before we, uh... Who 
Oops. Make sure we're at least friendly with her before we try anything romantic. Uh, no. No. Focus, buddy. Read a book about charisma. Alright, I think that means we're friends now. Yep, we are friends now. So, we're still being hilarious. So, we're going to impersonate celebrity. Make face. Dirty joke. It is most certainly like me. i tell another joke. No. Finish this, and then go to work. You can take a piss once you get to work. See ya. Well, I'd say we made pretty good progress with her that time. We are now friends. Sweet. We may get married in today's episode. Just kidding, we're going to probably end up getting engaged in today's episode. Well, we didn't prepare for the game in our last uh, episode when we went to work, but hopefully we win this. It's two to two, two to three. They got the lead now. Two to four. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. Three to four. Halfway through the game. Three to five. Okay, so now we actually do see the importance of preparing for the game before game days. Four to five. Last quarter. Five to five. Five to six. Away. Advantage. Six to six. Seven to six. We're ahead again. Eight to six. I think we got it. Seven to eight. Close. Nice. We win the game. Barely. Barely, barely, barely. Yes, I know that I just said barely. <laughs> Went down to Australia with that one. Tell you what, you have two wishes I can do really quick. Uh, let's send you down to the community pool where you are going to go swimming really quick. Swim it up, buddy. Okay, do a cardio workout. That's also easy to arrange. So let's have him go here first of all. Get out of the pool. Now jog here to don't break a sweat. Nice, easy wishes. Now get in a Jeep or in your car or whatever and get your butt back home. Oops, don't tinker with it. Take a shower in it. And then brush your teethers. Alright, it is up and around, and it's time to start the day. So, we have a desire to do gardening. Well, Derek, I got news for you, buddy. You're going to get two. <laughs> As a matter of fact. No, you won't get two. You will, you will. Of course, by the time you get to that uh, particular item, it might be a little bit too late. That's okay, though. Emerald cut luminorious gem. Interesting. Okay, so, we made it all the way up to being friends with Miranda. We were fast friends, and uh, hopefully, it's now five, so that means we should be able to tend garden. Just improved handiness to level eight. Nice. All right, well, there's that wish fulfilled. I don't see any new things down here, but that doesn't mean much. I don't see him harvesting anything, though. That's because he's not. Apples. Two oranges. 
Okay, let's keep building that, and then we're going to come in her. We're going to look for Miss Miranda and invite her over. Because we're totally not the stalker boy who's, a, who's chasing her like none other. It's totally not what we're doing. calling. From one chef to another, Molly French, a fellow chef, would like to discuss cooking with you to see if there are some tips to be gleaned from your culinary cranium. Meet up with Molly French to socialize and share cooking tips, and you might walk away with a few cooking tips and a relationship bonus. Hey, okie dokie. Well, first of all, I'm trying to invite Miranda over. Sure, you'll come over in a little while. Cook her favorite meal. Well, I gotta learn what her favorite meal is first. Recycle. Why are you trying to go back to bed, dude? You're even well rested. Why are you trying to go back to bed? Uh, pay the bill. While we're waiting on Miss Miranda. See, I'm getting suspicious of her because she's showing up in a different dang car every dang time. And the queue is full. So, let's hit it. This is totally how relationships work. Totally, totally. Let's erase that. We're going to erase our charisma before we learn our favorite food, I'm sure. We're being sociable, okay? This is totally how uh, this works, by the way. Totally. Thanks for being amusing. Now we're being uh, friendly. Let's see. We're going to do funny, goof around, and make a silly face, and then tell a funny story, and then tell an inside joke, and then tell a joke. <laughs> Such funny. We are now good friends. Nice. And we're going to repeat and goof around, then impersonate a celebrity, then joke about times because we're totally, we're old friends, totally. T dirty shit joke. That's why I tried to say dirty shit. And this wish. Best friends with Miranda, and I apparently have a strange desire to throw a party. And then we're going to start, uh, we're going to start off Ask If Single. Compliment her appearance, compliment her personality. Flirt, flirtatious joke, and an amorous hug. Miranda is single. Very alluring. Boy, this is uh, advancing quickly. Amorous hug, and then, uh, no, save a minute, buddy. Don't be too desperate. Give her a massage, then hold her hand. And tell her another joke. Give her... No, let's ask attraction first and then do your first kiss like a... like a noob. Nice. Learn two more of her traits. Okay, just improve charisma to level five. Can now make smooth recovery. Nice. Just confessed feelings, which means we get first romance and uh, first kiss, because Derek, of course, spawned in as a. Uh, yep. So let's kiss. Leave arms because that's how light I am. Wow. Talk about uh, jumping to conclusion. We can try before we're even a, a really thing. Really a thing. I don't have work today, do I? Nope. Today's my day off. Ha ha ha. No, 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 no. Go pee. Peek was next. Okay. So make up. Stroke her cheek. All right. We're going to do the big shebang. We are going to propose that we go steady. For those of you who aren't old farts like I am, going steady usually means that you're inviting them to uh, be, go on, on a you know date with you. Or be boyfriend, girlfriend. Okay, so now I can propose, propose. Okay, so what we're going to do is we are actually going to do a certain something here. We are now very much, uh, we've, we've managed to make a good impression and... Uh, Get close to Miss Miranda. We're not actually going to eat, though. We're going to prep 
because what we're going to do is we're going to take advantage of one of our things and we are going to see about, oops, wrong button, we're going to see if we can't go ahead and eat here. How do I, uh, how do I invite somebody out? I guess let's uh, eat outside and let's go here and then we'll uh, ask Miranda to come over here. Let's actually cancel this and we have a make out with Miranda goal. Let's get rid of the party thing too because I'm not going to be throwing a party. It did not gonna happen. And why are we here, you ask? Because we are going to ask Miranda out on a date. Okay. I kind of hoped that was Miranda right then. Nope, neither of them are Miranda. There's Miranda. Alright, so can I greet you? I can. Let's eat outside. And of course we have the uh, certain thing there. Oh, there they are. Okay, so Derek got a hamburger. Where's Miranda? There she is. And she got... <laughs> I come out with a hamburger, she comes out with a cookie, and then they sit at different tables. <laughs> Oh, that's perfect. That's fucking. Oh, that's hilarious. Um, go here. No interactions available. Can I? Can I do a make out with you? Yeah, make out in the at the restaurant. Yeah, raunchy. <laughs> make out. And I think I have the perfect way. We're now girlfriend, boyfriend. I think I have the perfect way to end today's or to end today's episode on. I think we are going to, if we can here. Let's uh, kiss and hold hands. See if I can get the interaction back. Simply irresistible. No. We are going to propose. Yay! We're now engaged. Congratulations, Derek and Miranda are now engaged. They can get married at a wedding party, or if they prefer something a little bit more intimate, a private wedding. Oops. Before we just take off, how about we, uh... Oops. Romantic. I think we're probably going to end up doing a private wedding, but that is going to wait for our next episode. So. This is going to be a pretty short episode, I think, but with that, all that being said... Thank you everybody for joining me for today's episode. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button. If you uh, want to see more content like this and want to especially follow the story of Derek Flargalarg, <laughs> be sure to subscribe. And uh, put uh, go ahead and hit that bell notification button and that way you can uh, be notified when I post new videos. Currently I upload on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Uh, if you have any feedback, please be sure to leave them down in the comment section below. And of course, if you have any, uh, I just said that, brain fart. So yes, thank you once again, everybody, for joining me for today's episode, and I will see you guys in the next video. See ya!